Now let's study Twinkle Twinkle Little Star with chords. What we can do with the left hand. I assume you have already learned to play the melody with your right hand. And um, this song uses three different chords. One of them would be the chord of C major. Then another one is F major. And the last one is G, G major or G7. But for simplicity's sake, I will just teach you to use the chord of G major. Okay. And um, the chords are easy in themselves, but the difficulty is that you would need to move your hand a lot because it changes the chord quickly and often. I hope you have your sheet music in front of you so you know where the chords actually go. It starts like this. So you, you could see how much my left hand was moving around here, especially the how I wonder what you are part. And that's why I want to show you an, a little bit different way of playing the chords that will be easier for beginners. Your hand doesn't need to move so much. And in that, we will not play all notes of the chords. We will play chord of C here in the beginning. But when it is time to play the chord of F, we will just play F and A here. And it is near. You play the chord of C here and then just finger number two on F and thumb on A. Like that. Let me show you with both hands. Twinkle, twinkle. And now we change. Little. Little star. And back to, back to C. Twinkle, twinkle, little star. Okay. And then we come how I wonder what you are and it changes between the chord of G and chord of C several times in that passage and again we can just play the two notes of the chord here you play G and B with finger number two and one and that way when you go to play chord of C it is very near like here you can even play just the two bottom notes of the chord of C C and E with finger number five and three and then you reach out with your two and one to play these and that is not a big movement it is much easier so we will play how i wonder what you are how i wonder what you are see it again see how my left hand switches between those this and this right hand goes down by steps Next part, up above the world so high, uses three chords. There's C, which you can play just the two of these. Then there's F, which you could play the two notes. Then G, uh, I'm sorry, then C back to C, and then to G. Let me show you that again. There's chord of C, then would be F, and C, and G. And your hand does not need to move very much when you just play the two notes for each chord. Practice this with your left hand first. And now we are ready to do it with the right hand. Right hand plays by steps from G down to D. Like this. then comes the end which is the same as the beginning twinkle twinkle little star how i wonder what you are if you want to you can then try also the fuller chords the full chords if you're ready to practice moving your hand a lot like this or maybe for some parts you can try that. For example, in the beginning, if you want to play the beginning so that you play C, chord of C, then chord of F fully from here. Twinkle, twinkle, little star. Like that. Then we would move with the chord of G. And there's many possible variations of this where you just play part of the chords, not the full chords, 
for example, you could play chord of G fully, and then when it comes to comes time to play the chord of C, you just play these two here. Okay, so you can experiment with that on your own. And soon enough you will be playing like a pro. Happy playing!